Centering an element can be done in various ways in various situations. In this video, we will discuss six different ways to center a div element. Here we have the parent and child elements. Start by applying styling on the parent element, set display to flex and align items to center, which will align the child element vertically center, then set justify content to center which will align the child element to center of the parent. Set display grid to the parent element, and set place items to center, which will align the child at the center. Now we will apply styling on the child element, whose width and height are set to 100 pixels. Then set its position to absolute, make sure to set the position relative for the parent element. Then set the child element at top 50% and left 50% as shown, and set the margin as minus 50 pixels, which will align the child at the center. As the width and height of the element is 100 pixels, I used half of its value as margin. If the value of the width is different, then I would change the margin accordingly. Set the child position to absolute and set top value as 50% minus 50 pixels using the calc function, which will align it vertically center. Then set the left at 50% minus 50 pixels, which will align the element at the center. Set position absolute at top 50% and left 50% for the child element. Then apply transformations and translate it by minus 50% in both X and Y axis, which will align the element at the center. Set the child's position to absolute, then set top, bottom, left, and right values to zero. And finally set margin to auto which will align the child at the center. A bonus trick is, if you remove all the position absolute styling and set display to block with margin auto, that will align the child horizontally center. If you find this tutorial valuable then subscribe to the channel.